Well, 23ABC continues to celebrate military veterans by sharing the stories of those who have fought for this country. Today, 23ABC's Bonnie Patino tells us a bit more about a veteran she met on Honor Flight who has picked up a hobby he uses to connect with fellow servicemen and women. Bonnie. That's right, Brianna. Well, you may recognize Phil for the colorful hair that made him stick out in the honor flight to Washington, D.C. But besides his daring personal style, he also brought gifts for all the veterans on the flight that, although small, meant a lot for him and those who received them. These represent Vietnam uh, from green to green. If you turn it sideways, that is the medal that they were awarded for serving in Vietnam. For Navy veteran Phil Roberts, these bead chains hold a lot of meaning. I present them to the veterans because to me they've earned it. So it's a gift to me for their service. Roberts dedicated 30 years of his life to our country from 1958 to 1978. He was part of the Navy during the Vietnam War and served as an aviation storekeeper. During his time, he was stationed overseas in Guam and Japan. He also had several stateside duty stations, including at the air station in Lemoore and the Moffett Federal Airfield just northwest of San Jose. About 20 years ago, he started making little bead keychains for his fellow servicemen, taking over the tradition from a close friend. Well, he was still working. I was retired. And he said, you want to take over these beads for me? And I said, yeah, I need something to do. Since taking up the mantle, Roberts has given thousands of keychains to fellow veterans, including those on the latest honor flight. There were 87 uh, Vietnam veterans that I made the 50 year anniversary ribbon for, or keychain for, and the seven Korea vets, the one World War II vet, and I made special ones for the river to riveter. Roberts has now expanded to making flags, crosses, and even holiday figures for his loved ones, but says there is nothing like the feeling he gets giving them away to veterans. Oh my God, I just feel so thankful and elated that I can present something to somebody that's made an impression on the world, and they have. Well, the other veterans on the flight hung their keychains to their jackets or bags and were all appreciative of the gift. Robert says he just hopes more veterans get to have this experience and join future honor flights. In studio, Vani Patino, 23 ABC News, connecting you.